Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly readings. This is going to be for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. For those of you guys that have been following our Tarot Lessons 101, um, just want to let you guys know that we're going back into schedule. I apologize, we've been extremely busy. Um, it's been a bit difficult to upload the videos uh, every Sunday, but we are going back in schedule again. So um, we will continue this Sunday. So you guys stay tuned for that. All right, let's get into your reading Aries. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys for this month of February 2022. I want to wish every single one of you guys happy Valentine's. For you singles out there, put yourself out there. Of course, be safe. <laughs> But do not be afraid to put yourself out there. Alrighty, let's see. Spirit guides, ancestors, and archangels, what are the messages for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for this month of February 2022? For those of you guys returning, thank you and welcome back. For those of you guys that are new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like, and also hit that notification bell so you guys can get notified of all the videos that are coming out. All right, let's get into your reading, Aries. First card here is the Hierophant. This is the energy that you're taking on for this month of February. Uh, this could represent uh, higher learning for some of you guys. It could be getting uh, an opportunity to invest in yourself, whether it's in career and finances. For some of you guys, it could be taking on a new project um, where it is required or necessary for you to uh, broaden your horizons when it comes to the knowledge and the experience that you have. Next card here is the Six of Pentacles. Six of Pentacles is giving and receiving, but it also indicates some type of commitment or some type of higher elevation, whether it's in career, finances, or love, that is give and receive. So as much effort as you put in for the month of February, Aries, you're also going to be experiencing the results, the fruits of your labor for this month. So beautiful energy. All right, let's get into it first card here is the shadow side you have the four of swords eight of swords the tower wow lovers and the karma card all right my lovely aries so i feel that for the month of february there's going to be um some type of situation that is going to be coming up for you guys that is very connected to either a karmic connection or something from the past uh, this could be a relationship this could be a connection this could be um, dealing with if you have children it could be dealing with the mother of your child or the father of your child um, it's finally coming to a culmination so for a lot of you guys if you've been experiencing almost like a difficulty of release or for some of you guys even difficulty to start some type of connections it almost seems like when you try to put effort or energy it kind of seems to fall apart and um, kind of reverts or you may be reverting back to the past however what spirit is telling you it's finally time to let go of this type of energy aries it's going to be necessary for you to be able to fully release yourself from anything that has to do with the past this could be past connections this could be past relationships uh this could even be friendships where uh there was some type of separation or some type of distancing um they may be coming back around but what spirit is telling you is finally it's time for you to really um take inventory of the people that bring greatness to you and those that hinder your progress those that keep you from being able to move forward or being able to expand if they're keeping you from this or bringing drama to you, now it's the time to fully release yourself from that. So what does this mean um, on, a, on, on a grander scale? There is major transformation that's coming up for you guys in this month of February. And I see you guys really letting go of toxic people, toxic situations, toxic relationships and connections that have kept you either stuck or in a never-ending type of cycle the tower is here so it does indicate you are already in this process you're already either coming to the realization for some of you guys this could come off as an aha moment for others of you it's fully seeing people like fully who they are and what they truly are and it's 
almost propelling you. It's almost like a, a opening of eyes to realizing um, if they have, you know, your higher interest or if they are just looking out for themselves and whatever is shown to you in this month of February, Aries, it's going to be very important to take it as is. Again, it's about opening up your horizons. It's about giving yourself the opportunity to experience uh, different cultures. Uh, this could be having to do with travel. This can also have to do with um, being around different people or people that you don't necessarily uh, maintain a connection in your social circle. Um, this is about being open completely to the universe. The lover's card does represent a connection. A connection may be coming in for you guys that is a soulmate type of connection. But what they're really stressing right now, it's going to be very important for this month to fully commit to yourself to new experiences. The lovers also represents being at crossroads. But within that process of us having to make decisions, um, the beauty behind it also, you know, brings to us a almost renewed type of energy. Uh, it gives you the power, the confidence in yourself to set out on a new journey and to not fear the future. So again, they're telling you, you know, whatever opportunities present themselves to you, if you feel inclined and you feel pulled towards them, definitely take that opportunity. Don't be scared to say yes, Aries. This is going to help you, like I said, open up your social circle. This is going to help you open up yourself to new cultures, new foods, new, uh, maybe a town you've never been to. Um, it's all about newness here because the tower does represent uh, bringing down or breaking down completely what your perspective is to be able to give you a new beginning, a new way of seeing things, a new way of experiencing things. So this is very beautiful type of energy, Aries. I want to wish you guys the very best and we'll see each other soon. Till then, bye.